What's up, what's up, Battle Brawlers? Bakugan Sensei here again, bringing you some more awesome Gundalian Invaders. This uh, is a brand new discovery that I made. Just picked these up yesterday. This is the brand new line uh, that is a special treatment from Walmart. It is called the Bakugan Stealth. And uh, it is exclusive at Walmart. Speaking of special treatments, uh, those of you uh, who watch this channel regularly and my subscribers saw me unbox and introduce the Crimson and Pearl uh, to you, which is on the shelves now at Target. This is Walmart's version. And uh, let me tell you, just right up front, I am so impressed with the quality of this packaging. The fantasy artwork just is amazing. Uh, I didn't want to open up the special treatment Crimson and Pearl or have my son open them up, but this even more so. I mean, this just should be on a shelf. It is the nicest packaging on a toy that I have seen in a while, certainly on, on, on a uh, Bakugan. So, of course, Battle Gear compatible, uh, as you can't already tell, I'm sure, but we've got a uh, mighty-looking strike flyer there in the picture. I believe this is a Heos, but we have not seen the, the uh, attribute. You can't see the attribute anywhere on him. Uh, on his wings or feet or body, but uh, we think that it's a Heos. And uh, again, the series is called Bakugan Stealth, and uh, this particular one is called Bakugan Granite. And I've seen some of these on eBay before, uh, black market sales, where I didn't know if it was a counterfeit or not. It's kind of a light gray stone type finish to this Bakugan, and then it has a mottled or speckled gray fleck to it. So uh, the whole stealth series uh, is about stealth and the shadows. Uh, if you're battling, how can you battle uh, with more stealth? And uh, to that theme, this is uh, uh, the Baku Granite. So again, when he's sitting in his ball form or he's in his monster form, he's going to be hiding out. You're going to walk right by him because you think he's a big, powerful granite boulder. So uh, we're excited to open this up. Uh, my eight-year-old is joining me here to uh, unbox this one. It's going to be part of his team. And... Uh, we're just really excited to get into this thing. Now these ones, unlike the normal Baku Boost and also the Crimson Pearl, which are $4.99 or $5.49, this guy is $7.88, but uh, it's really not too much. I think it's worth it because uh, those new Vestroya traps cost me $7.88 and those uh, uh, special attacks cost me $7.88 and some of them really weren't too special at all. So it's always cool to go to a brawl and whip out one of these special treatments uh, something that nobody has, and they're like, wow, where'd you get that Bakugan? So something to be said for a shiny set of clothes, and this is a very shiny, cool uh, set of clothes here. Again, Bakugan Stealth, flip over the back of the packaging, uh, nothing that we haven't seen before, so I'm really not even going to cover it this time. It's got the DNA code, and you'll be able to brawl online with Bakugan Dimensions, and that's really all the time that uh, the back of the cover is going to get here. Let's uh, get into this unboxing here with my son. <clears throat> Ooh, some shiny foil inside, too. All right, so you guys know the drill. I, I like to start with uh, the cards to tell you what uh, is, it's going to come with. And so our first card is the very underwhelming VR Arena number one. Um, <laughs> seen a few of these before, but uh, uh, it is what it is. Uh, 200 to Subterra, 150 to Pyrus, 150 to Aquos, and 180 Heos. So slight advantage uh, for Subterra and Heos on this card. Uh, cool looking shadow artwork there in the back, but we've all seen it before on that silver gate card. Uh, build a card, picture of uh, Helix Drago there. There's no power level required, and uh, the card actually is the Helix Dragonoid card. So play before you roll a Helix Dragonoid. If you stand on an empty gate card, you may move any other standing Bakugan to the same gate card. So cool ability card, red ability card. <clears throat> all right. I think he, uh, my son's got it unwrapped here. Let's see if we can roll this guy out on the stage and uh, see, see what he stands like. All right, so there's a stand. There is a stand to uh, Strike Flyer. And uh, did you find out? Is he, is he, is he Heos? What is his uh, attribute? Did you look? No. Nope. Why don't you check and see? He is Heos. All right, so uh, Strike Flyer uh, will be part of my son's Heos team. And uh, it's just tough with this camera here. You want to unfold that, his manual parts <coughs> for everyone? Do his horn and everything. He's got little feet or claws. Feet or claws that come out there on him. Cool. All right, so uh, this is what he looks like. And uh, I don't know if you can get that on the camera, but it's all speck uh, speckled gray fleck. Very much like a rock or granite. 
Now, what's interesting is he actually has some uh, yellow and green trim, which you might think that he is a darkest. You might confuse him, but uh, no, he is a granite special treatment. Baku granite special treatment, part of the new Stealth series. So this guy can camouflage himself and hide out next to the granite boulders, and you won't even see him there before he strikes and attacks. So I'm trying to get in on the G-Power. The G-Power is kind of a little odd place. I don't know if the camera can make it out there, but it looks like this Bakugan is a 770G. Yes, we do love strong and high-power Bakugan around here. I make no secret about it. We want to bring you the toughest. We want to bring you the strongest Bakugan that are out there on the market. So this is yet another one, a 770G. I think you can see the finish there on the camera a little bit better. It's got the gray uh, speckle on it. Obviously, the post the new GI Bakugan come with for accepting all of the new uh, trap battle gear. And uh, make sure I show you there, he's got his uh, wings out. He's got his little feet that extend on either side as far as his manual parts. Uh, some cool markings on it. Uh, again, uh, all uh, gray or granite kind of rock markings because that's the sub-series that this guy is. And uh, cool looking Bakugan. Um, there's his DNA code. Again, they all come with a DNA code, and not a lot more to mention uh, other than that about him. So uh, I'm sure if you love Heos, like uh, Kodok, you're going to want this guy in your collection because uh, 770Gs uh, is pretty powerful. And uh, again, a, a very cool, special-looking treatment that will separate your Bakugan from your friend. So why don't you uh, put him into ball form, and we'll uh, let him do his thing on stage one more time. I'll watch it there as you fold it up. Is he pretty easy to fold up? Pretty simple. Okay. Let's set this field back up here a little bit. And uh, see if you can uh, stand him out there. All right. Love it when you uh, stand the first time. So there he is. Pretty cool looking. Don't want to mess with this guy. Hey, I'll strike flyer 770G only at Walmart. Special treatment. Part of the new Stealth series. They're on the shelf now. Go down this weekend and get them, guys. This series launches March 1st. Hopefully, we'll be able to brawl online. But in the meantime, we're going to keep bringing you more unboxings of this uh, exclusive uh, treatment to Walmart and even maybe some more Target. So that's the latest and greatest. Uh, just to give you a sneak peek on what else we still have to share with you, we're not going to unbox these. It's kind of like a kid in the candy store. We're trying to pace ourselves, but we've been running around the last couple of days, or rather I've been running around to find the, the latest and greatest in Bakugan. And I've managed to get my hands on it to share with you, my viewers and my subscribers. Um, this is actually another Bakugan Stealth. This is a Ventus. And, and you can be fooled because you can see he looks like a Darkest. But this is a Ventus and, and he's called Baku Camo. So again, he's stealthy when he battles because he camouflages and hides. Again, that killer awesome foil artwork uh, is, a, is featured but in Ventus because he's Ventus attribute. There is also a, uh, another Baku Granite uh, of the Derok. If you see this guy, you'll be pretty pleased with him too. And um, he, uh, he is a, a good component for someone looking for one of those Deroks. I know you Darkest Brawlers out there, I'm with you. We love all that power, that 750G, that 790G Derok. I know he's our guy, but uh, this is a little bit of love for uh, those brawlers out there that that uh, that, that brawl with the uh, Heos team. So, And the final one, which I think we're going to probably still try and do an unboxing of this guy tonight because he just looks so epic. Uh, this is another Bakugan Stealth. This one is the only one uh, in this series. This is called Baku Shadow. And... Uh, you probably can't see, but he's not a normal darkest Bakugan. He's actually kind of a dark gray color. The idea, again, is hiding out in the shadows. Stealthy special attack. So more coming soon. Thanks for watching, you guys. Please remember to comment, rate, subscribe, and tell all your brawling friends because we know what's going on. We're sharing it with you so you know what's going on. So Gundalian, Gundalian, whatever you want to call it, GI Rocks, we're excited, and we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.